Look for you. No soup for you. No soup for you. Welcome back, Hot Wheels hunters. Thank you for joining us for another episode of Toy Jizz, where we go nuts <laughs> over Hot Wheels diecast model cars, action figures, and the latest collectibles. Today, in search of some new cars, we're taking a look at a new Walmart and a new Dollar General. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. Today, we are starting out at our, well, relatively local uh, Dollar General. And, uh, um, my guess is, hey, uh, these these cars are going to look kind of uh, familiar to you. Yeah, I'm going to go through these uh, because, hey, you never know. But uh, we're kind of getting into the um, area, I guess, the time period of um, around me. These cars are just uh, kind of old and kind of sitting here. I'll probably end up grabbing that coupe clip. But, uh... I mean, most of them are kind of old, kind of sitting around. They've kind of been gone through, uh, by me even, at this point. Um, oh, and there's that um, green one that I like again. Is this the day I'm going to buy it? I don't know. D-Case. I don't know, you guys. Uh, but anyway, yeah, what I'm getting at is uh, some of these um, videos from... Um, Basically, the pegs around where I'm at uh, may be kind of repetitive at this point. And I don't know whether to kind of keep doing that and show you the quote-unquote real hunt. Or um, kind of just let that go. Um, anyway, one of the things we're going to try to do is go to a different Walmart today. And see, hopefully... Hopefully, maybe we can get a little bit of different footage here. And also, hopefully, find some different cars, too. Uh, and here's the uh, Hot Wheels section here. See, uh, we haven't seen that one yet at all. So, I got high hopes for these cards, man. Um, see a green, see me rolling. We got some different stuff going on here. Some stuff I haven't seen before. So, I'm kind of excited about that. There's the uh, gold locomotron shout out to the Florida man and that's the first time I've seen this Lotus a lot of people kind of go ape shit for that but uh meh whatever it doesn't really do anything for me there's the uh, snowstormer that's the first time I've seen that I kind of like that, actually. I'll probably end up getting one of those. There's the orange uh, focus. First time I've seen that, I'll end up getting one of those at least. Maybe two if they got them even. There's that little car. You know I've been... Uh, trying to look at those at least, but yeah, I uh, I have not found that treasure hunt yet that kind of supposedly looks like that at least. There's something or other I haven't seen before. Nothing fancy that I can tell of. Hey, look, OMG. First time we've seen the Kafer, or the Kaffer. I don't know how you pronounce that exactly. But, um, you know, one way or another, it's kind of based, actually. I've been kind of looking for those. Um, it's an ugly, stupid little beetle. Meanwhile, um, eh, so sometimes you just kind of glom on to something from Hot Wheels. That might be the one I glom on to. Um, I might try to get a bunch of gaffers. We'll just kind of see. There's that one again. I don't like how boxy that car is. Ooh, hey. Uh, the Mazda... RX3, that's kind of cool looking. That's darker green than I thought it was going to be, but uh, whatever. I kind of like it. Another Kaffer. Based. Yo, base. Mm, 
not a super. There's a lot of stuff. Ooh, that Audi. That Audi's new. I haven't seen that before. Eh, I don't know. I'm thinking about it. We'll see. Blue focus. There's a old Honda. Pretty plain looking car, but I guess that's a big deal, whatever. Another orange focus. Another Audi. That e-tron. I kinda you know, Audis are kinda I mean they're expensive, they're high performance cars. They usually kinda look like grandma cars, they usually kinda look like a sleeper car, you know. There's a red um that WRX STI that I've seen for the first time. I kind of don't like those hatchback looking vehicles. Meanwhile, the paint job on those is kind of cool. So I'll end up grabbing that. Another Audi. Another orange Focus. A lot of this stuff looks pretty picked over, but let's, I guess, you know, this is a big deal for me. I haven't seen any of a lot of these cars, so we'll take a look at some of this other stuff here and see if there's anything worth getting. Usually the premium cars I'm really not that interested in, um, especially those Disney ones. Um, there's some van or some shit, like the cool combi or something, that's the thing to buy and resell there. I couldn't give a fuck either way. like the color on that little matchbox but yeah that car's nothing special as you can see it's it's pretty well gone over but like i said i did find a few cars out of this whole deal that uh, i hadn't seen before so that's a plus at least let's take a look again at some of these premiums there's one of those fast and the furious cars i haven't seen any of those until now and obviously they're pretty picked over Some of these more premium Jada vehicles and the bigger die casts and what have you. This is honestly just kind of a better, a bigger Walmart than I kind of normally go to. A little better stocked, obviously. Um, oh, oh, I found a uh, dump box. Let's, uh, ooh. That's supposed to be a big deal now, right? Oh, that's the uh, red uh, Bronco. First time seeing that. That's kind of cool. I'm still not going to buy it. There's the Baja Bug. First time seeing that. Ooh, the motorcycle. Going to have to grab one of those. Ooh, there's the uh, Jaguar. And another one of those Mazdas. The Glory Chase. Kind of a plain looking vehicle. I don't think I'm going to grab it. There's two of those motorcycles. You know, I like those motorcycles. Oh, and there's the Batmobile. Finally found one of those out in the wild. Nice. Another one of those Subaru. Another one of those Storm Chasers. Or Snowstormers, that's what it's called, my bad. 
Oh, uh, gold Chevy. I think that's the first time I've seen that car. I'll grab one of these. And there's kind of my collection already, as you can see. Oop, there's the first time seeing one of those um, Fast and the Furious uh, chargers. The mainline charger, you know, not the premium models. There's a uh, Mustang. Hmm. Kind of ugly, but I kind of liked it too. Oh, I think that's the first time I'm seeing one of these. I'll probably end up grabbing that again here in a minute. Oh, there's a red of the the E Mustangs. Yeah, I'm still not gonna buy it. Still ugly. Another Jaguar. Sorry. There's a first time grabbing one of those kit cars, the Super Pursuit mode. That's the first time seeing one of those. That's kind of a rarity for me to find, for sure. Um, you know, that usually gets snapped up a lot of times in these treasure hunt videos. Oh, and there's the first time seeing the white version of that Ford uh, GT. manga whatever those are actually kind of cool looking cars i just i never end up getting it because it's you know a fantasy car uh but whatever another mazda Another Jaguar, it is just the main line, of course. Another Audi e-tron. Hey, that's the first time I'm seeing uh fuck, I can't even remember what the hell that car was. Kind of piling crap on top of another anyway now we're at a different ooh and we already see a uh treasure hunt there just sitting there didn't even have to 
the card for that. Card's pretty fucked up, but uh, I'm gonna take it anyway. I guess I got an opener now. But anyway, uh, we're at a different Dollar General than normal, and uh, you can probably kind of tell um, a lot of um, the stock here they've got kind of looks older. Um, got some age on it, probably last year's cases, that sort of thing. Um, but anyway, you know, ever in the quest for something different, something new, different places to look for stuff, um, here I am. And let's... Here's a, uh, blue, uh, GTO. That's kind of fucking cool looking. I'll take that. Here's a, uh, Mustang. Kind of with some cool wheels on it and a, uh, different motor kind of sticking out the top of it. That's kind of different. Check this out. Here's a uh, Aston Martin. Kind of different looking. I haven't seen anything like this before. Uh, not a super or anything as far as I can tell. It's different looking, but I don't know that I'm going to buy it, actually, you know. another uh, GTO. You know how I like to buy two of these bad boys. Why wouldn't I? Out. I haven't seen one of these before. This is a uh, Hot Wiler. Like a uh, Rottweiler, but a Hot Wheels. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know that I'm going to get it. If I was a little kid, that's probably kind of cool, but eh, I think I'm going to skip it. Here's one of the uh, Pattinson Batmobiles. Okay. You know, I don't know why. Um, I've seen these before. I've seen them a bunch of times. Um, I think it's kind of a cool looking Mad Max car, but um, as a Batmobile, it's it's not really my cup of pee. Uh, meanwhile, it is kind of a, looking, a cool looking car. Um, so I guess I'll give it that, you know. It's a cool car. It's just not really a good Batmobile. I don't know if that makes sense or not. Like, um, I mean, would you drive the Batmobile down the street? No. Would you drive that car down the street? Yeah, you could You could probably get away with that and not be looked at like a total fucking weirdo, you know? A lot of, a lot of car clips here. They got a lot of those here, too. Okay. Here's their uh, Matchbox selection. Matchbox, usually, you know, I talk shit on the color schemes and paint jobs on the Hot Wheels, I know. But the Matchbox, um, they're usually just, unless it's some fan, uh, well, not a fantasy car, but like a, um, you know, some foreign uh, car. Like, look at this. I mean... Now, that's kind of hot looking, you know, with the gold rims and all that. Otherwise, uh, they're usually kind of plain looking, too plain looking, like, just kind of boring, in my opinion. Ooh, what's that? Kind of like the look of that. Oh, it's a McLaren. I thought it was like a Corvette for a second. I kind of like that color. But anyway, guys... Taking a look around for anything in this place. 
to some character cars. Anyway, guys, that's our Hot Wheels hunt for today. We got to see some new places and some new cars, luckily enough. We didn't find any supers, but at least we got a regular treasure hunt, I guess. Ah, it's better than nothing. As always, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to get notifications of new videos sent directly to your phone and inbox. Follow us on Instagram and stay tuned for another video from Humane Garbage.